Our good friend Alexander Smalls is an award-winning chef, author, restaurateur, and opera singer. In his new cookbook, The Contemporary African Kitchen, Home Cooking Recipes from the Leading Chefs of Africa, he's spotlighting the region's diverse culinary voices and cuisine. So he joins us to make two recipes from the book. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome How's back. So happy Congrats to be on here. The book. Yes. Doesn't that smell amazing? This it smells really amazing, does. and I don't want to burn it. And these are so, just some of the best recipes from the, the best chefs across Africa. Oh, absolutely. Leading chefs in Africa uh -huh. who are preparing dishes for the home cook. So, I mean, it's a fantastic array of things. Mm -hmm. You know, and starting here, what is giving us that most incredible mm -hmm. smell what? is the masala. Ah. The masala is made up of cinnamon, cardamom, cumin, cloves, and black peppercorn. Okay. And you, you roast that until you start smelling it like ah, that. Okay. And then you grind it, you know, and okay. it becomes a seasoning, which is over there. Mm -hmm. But this is how we start this. You know, you, there's a whole chicken in here. Right. And so we salt and pepper this chicken, ba 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 as much as you like. I happen to like lots of it. Uh, <laughs> throw, throw so do we. That so do salt we. on there. there you go. You both know, sides? Both, well, that'll be good. Okay. Oh, we'll work it in. Yeah. We'll leave something for the chef to decide on. And so the garlic it goes on here and then we're going to pop up pop, 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 like this and this is the What's marinade that? this is the um, uh, soy sauce okay oh, okay so we're gonna massage this all up okay and do this kind of thing and then we set it to marinate for about 30 minutes okay okay, minutes, okay. and then once you do that then you're gonna slide it in the oven thank you and you're going to preheat the oven to 350 uh -huh. when in doubt always 350 right? okay <laughs> and then you're gonna roast it like this on for about own, 25 like minutes okay uh -huh. and then you put that on the side there then we get to this big pot. Mmm. All right, so we've got the onions, we've got the marsala, mm -hmm. which is this. Oh, Did you get a chance to smell? Uh, uh -huh. That's great. Egg. Oh, I do like that. Uh huh. And all that onions and the mm -hmm. garlic and the marsala goes all in right. here. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to put in the potatoes. You know, what kind of potatoes are you using this? Well, you know, I use any kind, okay. but here we're using Yukon. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, oh. it, it mm -hmm. really is up to the to the cook to decide. Stir all of that up. Then we're going to put in the rice, mm -hmm. and this is basmati rice. Oh my God. Oh. And we're going to That's then true. put in four cups of water. Now, I like to use broth. I was going to say, but, that you okay. Use broth. Um, well, I like flavor on top of flavor on top of flavor. And this is going to cook down mm -hmm. and uh, simmer, cook down, and it's going to become this, mm. okay? This is fantastic. Is it incredible? And so then this wonderful uh, uh, sal uh, salsa, mm -hmm. uh, let me show you how we make that. Okay. Follow me over here, <laughs> right here, okay. In this bowl, you have some onions, you have some tomato, mm -hmm. you have avocado, and you have mango. Mm -hmm. And um, the, the interesting thing is flavor. Always flavors and textures. Flavor on flavor on flavor. Flavor on flavor. Flavor, on flavor, flavor, flavor. Because, yes, because that's how we do it. Okay. All right, so we've got some cumin here. Mm -hmm. We put in. Could you use leftover masala? You could. You know, but, but this exactly. will balance it out okay. a little bit better. We don't want to run out of any time here because we want right. to get to the dessert. Bob, Bob put that salad. in there. You have to make this put a little salt in there, Al. And uh, yes, and then mix it go. all together. And that's your side. Sometimes I like to serve it on shredded uh, lettuce, mm -hmm. like romaine or cabbage. Now for dessert. You're making okay. a little uh, uh, parfait. Sort of. Okay, so this is cookie banana pudding. Mm -hmm. We know it best as banana pudding. Sure. <laughs> you know, but again, these dishes mirror many of our southern traditions. So here in a jar, you've got the cookies. Right. And then you're going to, and there they are here. What kind and you're going to take some bananas. Uh, can you use any kind of cookie? Uh, you, know, you can, but, um, you know, in the south, we use oh, wafers. Lemon. Oh, there's like a lemon But cookie. these are, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you put the bananas And then right you in. just kind of layer But I mean, that's how you own the dish. Mm -hmm. You decide to oh, yeah, you layer, you uh -huh. put in the custard. And you, for, a, for a quick More custard. Gonna, what is that? This is the vanilla Inst custard. You okay. Could use, or you could use instant pudding, right? Well, you could, yes. Yeah. And if you're looking for time. Just like, you no, know, no, you really should. All right. But, but oh my the gosh. pudding is so good made, custard. This All right, is... and then on top of that, you put a little cream, and then you layer uh, it again if you have room oh in your God. thing. Wow. Boom, 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 mm. boom, da. Alexander, it's fun to make. Fantastic. <laughs> what, like, an wow. explosion of flavors this is. Woo. You can now save your favorite recipes from the show. Scan the QR code or head to today.com slash food to get these recipes and set up your free account. The Contemporary African Kitchen, home cooking recipes from the leading chefs of Africa, is out now.